We're here at Don't Ever Bank Care Field in Cracks and Skull, Florida. Come here for the retirement. Stay here for the drive through funeral services. Getting buried has never been so quick and easy. I wouldn't mind taking a dirt nap here. Although my dream for years has been to be soaked in rum, then thrown into a volcano. <laughs> I like the idea of going out with a bang. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Hexon Oilers take on the Crocs and Skull Jugulars. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner Bricks and Bricks Jr. Hey man, these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. And it's first and ten. There, maybe a yard. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Second down and nine. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't. And the defense goes for the juggler and runs. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. I don't know which they are. <laughs> the offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. Second and three. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pad, Grim. You're right. First up. Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. And, oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for...
for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself down. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. First and ten. And that is caught for a first down. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. And it's first and ten. What's that, Grim? A fabulous interception. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. <laughs> Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> First and ten. Second down in a lot. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. Second down, and, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant, bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck! And it's first and ten. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. His cleats, boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, 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 I got bingo. You gotta love a player who goes down fighting. That's a touchdown saving tackle right there. The offense lost their final quarterback. Lucky for them, they're on defense now or the game would be over. Uh, so all the other team has to do is punt the force of forfeit? That 
would be correct, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And it plays a defense. Schmuck. Second down and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. throw and the defense gets a big sack. And it looks like the offense is desperate for a first down. Second down and six. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player. Kaboom! Dead and down. We delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, still working on my... The Crunch and Skull jugular seem to have run out of people to kill and win this one by forfeit. I should have known they'd know about anatomy. What would they name? Pull the other guys apart and demonstrate it, though. This was practically a science show. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you not? shut the hell up right now and we go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say? <laughs> Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...